the sexual abuse, I was sexually abused by Father Alphonse Robert in the summer of 1963. Um, I then didn't start any action uh, against the church until January of 2014. In that period of time, I suffered with the trauma and, and the nightmares and the night terrors of this sexual abuse. Uh, we started the action in 2014. It went to trial in 2017. We won at that time, at which point they um, uh, appealed the decision, which went to the Court of Appeal, uh, which was heard in November 2018, and the decision came down two days ago. So at this point, once the uh, decision from the appeal court has come down, my understanding at this point is that this is, deal is now closed and as a survivor of sexual abuse, what that means is now I'm free of this. I'm finally free of the trauma that the Catholic Church has put me through uh, throughout the process, but especially upon appealing a decision of a jury that uh, because they didn't think the money was warranted. Uh, so hopefully I have my life back now and we can move forward in not only our own lives but in working with other men who, who are going through similar situations. Overall, the I am okay with the fact that the church wanted to take this to trial. Our judicial system says that. I think it's unconscionable that a church then appeals a decision by a jury. They put me through two more years of trauma that wasn't necessary. I feel now at peace with the fact that a decision's been made and I can move forward with this, but I still have work to do in the resentment against this Catholic Church that is saying one thing and doing another. There is no transparency and hopefully in the future we can have some help in fixing that.